Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to draw a hook using AutoCAD Mechanical 2022. So here you can see the hook and I'm going to draw it using AutoCAD. So here I'm going to take a new file, AutoCAD, to draw this new. Then now, as you can see, we got the face for drawing. We can make it smaller. Okay, so you can see here I have to take the line command and I have to input lines as usual. Okay, so from here I'm going to start the drawing. So we have to take the line command again. From here I have to input and the measures. Here you can see the size of this line. Um, this line between this line to this line is 23 so here it will show 23 so i have to take 11.5 in each side 11.5 and then it will show also 11.5 so as i am taking from the distance of 11.5 i can put 23 on the second line okay so here we have to go we have to say another thing that here it is c2 T2 means the curve of this is 45 degree and the distance of this is 2 millimeter. So I am taking the line common again and from the center I am going to input 2 here to make the distance at 2. As you have seen the distance is created and here 11.5 is 23. Okay, so now I have to take the ray command actually to trim these lines. Now I have to trim it from here to the another portion, here to the another portion. So I'm switching the line here. Here, sorry, here. Remote as I have taken remote, I can also select it. Get it from there to here. Okay, I can also switch the line, so it should be like uh, another pointer. Okay, so here it is uh, the point is already created. So I have to take the line command and make the jointing points of that line. So as you can see, the jointing points is created. You can see here the size from this line to this line is 38. As you can see, 38 from this line to this line. So we can go for it, but uh, you can see I have taken the line here at the distance of two. So where I'm taking the line distance of two. So when I'm going to input this line, we have to input 36. As you can see, I have taken this 36 and from here also I have to take 36. So we can go for the another portion now. I uh, have uh, jointed those lines and you can see in the picture the distance between these two this is 30 so uh, if I want to go for it I have to make the distance between this is 30 so I have to input 15 on each side as previous so 15 here and here I can input 30 because I am taking the line and the distance from 15 okay so you can see that it's created i'm taking in a random line as you can see i'm taking random lines random lines so there is no issue on taking lines but uh, we have to say another thing in this picture there is a curves this curves that this this curve, the size of these curves is radius 
five. So to make the radius three point five circle here, I have to input the line command, and from this point, I have to go for the upper three point five, and it will be on each side. So uh, the side three point five. So I get the point for the circles. So I am selecting the point from here, and the radius is also same 3.5 to get this circle as you can see the pointer is created so i am taking the circle command again from this point i have to input 3.5 so in both sides 3.5 command is created now i am going for entering another command tr tr double enter means trim so i am going to trim the lines extra lines here as you can see i am trimming I have trimmed the extra lines so now you can see that the portion is created like as it okay you can see this whole portion is created now we have to go for the this section so for this section we have to go for this section actually so to make this section we have to make this point first we have to get this point first so this point from this point to this point the distance is 90 so we can get the point easily if we make the distance so i am taking line command again from here the line command is inputting at the distance of 90 okay so I get the point, I'm taking a random line, any size or any shape. And another we can go for the another liner. You can see the another line is also at the distance of 15. So I'm going for it. I'm entering the size 15. As you can see, the size 15 is inputted. So now we can go for the another thing. Here you can see the distance of this curve is 40 as mentioned here so the distance of these curves is 40 means the radius of this curve is 20 so we have to make a circle here at the radius of 20 so i am taking the center point and making a circle of 20 so after that we can see in this picture the another radius is 48 but this radius is at the distance of 9 from this point so we have to go and select the line command again we have to input here we have to input here 9 so that we can get the another point here we get the another point for our another circle at the size of 48 as you can see selected now i can input 48 and enter so you can see the curves this line is created so now we have to work for to make this heady section so to make this portion actually to make this portion we have to careful we have to draw for this we have to make a circle from here at radius of 60 because you can see here the distance of this radius is 20 and there is another radius is 40 so 20 plus 40 equals to 60 so i am selecting circle command from this center point i am inputting it is 60 enter so you can see we get the point here so from this point i have to draw another circle at the size of 40 enter so you can see that this is mixed at this point so there is no issue on this circle so for another circle we can see here it this is on the outer line so this is at the radius 48 and here is radius 23 so radius 48 plus radius 23 equals to 71 as we know so we have to draw the circle from this point at the size of radius 71 so i'm going to take the circle 
from this point 71 enter so you can see we get the point here so from this point i have to take the circle actually at the size of 23 so you can see there is a jointing line and now we have to go for making this this curve at radius 4 so to make this curve we have to take the point first we have to ensure the point where we are going to take this radius 4 degree so for this we can see this is the point between this line and this line so we have to subtract 4 from 40 and add 4 with 23 it means 27 and 36 so i'm going to do this you can take the circle command from here you have to input 36 36 and another so again circle command from another point this point is 27 as we are entering we can see the point here so now i have to go the for the main circle this four so you can see this point is created now i'm going for the trim command to see the exact visuals so here you can see i'm trimming i'm trimming actually all the lines to see the exact visuals it because i have cut the wrong lines again wrong lines i think we have to trim carefully so that we can't cut any wrong line on any position So you can see the portion of this is created actually. So we can go for uh, another thing that now we have only these two portion is left radius 60 and radius 40. So to take these radiuses we have to first input 60 mm distance a liner straight liner from this line. So we are going for this first. We have to take the line mode, line command. So from this point at the distance of 60, we have that a straight line. Okay. So now we can go. Uh, from here, we can see that this line is mi mixed with the line of radius 20. So it means we have to take the radius 80 to get the pointer here. To make this radius 60 curves line so we are going for it take the circle command from the center it is 80 so you can see we get the pointer here now we can select the circle mode pointing here and take the radius 60 now you can see the line is mixed with this but we can see there is a gap so we can Remove this gap by using line command and mixing it up at the exact point. Okay, so you can see that our this portion is almost completed. We can go for trim. So for this, we have to first key our double enter. You can see. So here is the here is the lining is created. So we can see here the another thing that this is at the radius of 40 from this line. So 
the distance should be from this line at the distance of 40 a straight liner i have to input so i am taking the line command again from here i have to input 40 enter as as previous i can input any straight line i am inputting 50 so now i have to ensure that the curve is with this line the outer line it is 48 here so the radius here is 40 48 plus 40 equals to 88 so i have to make the circle of 88 degree from here at the radius of 88 actually so i am taking the radius 88 inputted so you can see the pointer here so from this point actually from this point i have to draw this at the radius 40 enter so you can see all the line here, here is not clear so we have to trim to get the exact visuals as previous we are trimming all extra lines actually so that we can get the exact view of the project so i am trimming all the extra lines as you can see now you can see the picture easily so as you can see i have trimmed all the lines most of the lines actually most of the lines So I am taking the pen mode. Okay, now we can compare with the picture. Uh, sorry, uh, we can compare with this picture. Now, see the picture. Everything. I am removing all the mark. So you can see the picture is as same as this. So at the size their size and their everything is same so we can see that we can draw this hook using only three things that circle line and the common trim so this is the easy process to draw a hand a hook using autocad mechanical 2022 hope you enjoyed my video if you enjoyed my video please do not forget to like share and subscribe